All right, guys, so we have some more news on Seven Days to Die and the Alpha 22 update. Now, this will be getting into the lore of Seven Days to Die. So what we've been hearing and seeing on Seven Days to Die's official Twitter or X is they're going to be giving us more stuff about the lore of Seven Days to Die. And I think that's absolutely awesome because that's something that we really didn't have a whole lot of in this game was the lore. And we're going to be jumping into that. I'm going to show you some pictures of some stuff and let's get it going. So here's one of the new newspaper clippings as virus decimates America on Navis Game Inquirer. And it says, as the world sits in fear, landmark reports say U.S. <clears throat> US healthcare on the verge of collapse and with no cure in sight, many fear Arizona will be next. So that's one of the new newspaper clippings. We also have nuclear detonation. Now before on the older version, we had the newspapers that we could find and it was cut off. You could see nuclear, but you couldn't see the other part. So this one has the full part on it on the Davis Gain Tribune, where it says nuclear detonation. May God forgive us. President orders nuclear launch in desperate attempt to contain virus millions dead. And if we go back one more, there's some trash there. That's not really what we're looking for. There was another one. Here we go. Uh, ba ba ba. This is another part of that other one we saw. There's new clips coming out here, and I really like that they're going to get more into the lore of the game because that's a huge thing that we've missed out a lot on. All the games that you play, they all have a lore behind them, and this one didn't have a whole lot. So now that we're finally getting some more of that, I think it's really cool. I love that they're giving us more in-depth stuff on the lore of the game, even though it's just newspaper clippings. It'll be cool stuff to be able to find out in the world of Navis Gain, to have, to look at, to invest more into the game, to bring it to life a little bit more, and new things for people to search for and try to find to see what else is out there. And it talks, uh, there was some stuff I found where it talks about the Duke and things like that. I think it's going to open up more stuff about their story and maybe with the story of the Raiders about, you know, what brought them about. Um, that's not entirely confirmed, but that was some speculation that's been going around as well. But I'm super excited, you guys. I think that this new added part of the game is going to bring a lot of life to a game that is already so amazing, but it just didn't have that lore background for people to invest themselves into that part of it. So bringing this in is gonna be absolutely amazing. And when you look at it, you'll see right here, it says new decals are coming to Alpha 22 on PC, PS5 and Xbox Series S and X consoles. So that's great news for the console community that, you know, they're, they're posting everything they post is coming out with all the consoles, so that's really nice. Um, great work by Hung and Brian. Those, I'm assuming those are the ones who made these, so that's pretty cool. The console version will be out this year. Stay tuned. This came out February 4th, so not too long ago, but I think this is really, really cool that they're giving us this information, even though it's just little tidbits. You know, they're, they're keeping us guessing, but giving us enough to speculate on and talk about and keep the motivation for people to keep playing this game, giving them that little bit to keep them going. I'd love to hear in the comments from you guys what your thoughts are on the lore of the game or what you think about it, if you're excited for it or if you don't really care about the lore and you just love playing Seven Days to Die because you like to kill the zombies, I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments below. But other than that, that's going to do it for this video. If you did enjoy, make sure to smash that like button. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, and I will catch you guys in the next video.